Hello, we've been asked a number of times different questions on ArcGIS Online. The one that most commonly occurs is how do we uh, generate a hosted feature service in uh, or create a hosted feature service in ArcGIS Online. So we thought we'd walk through in this video how to do that. You can see on the screen uh, we've logged into our ArcGIS Online account and we've gone to my content. We've set up a separate folder called Demos where we'll put this uh, hosted uh, feature service. First thing you want to do is click the add item button. You'll see this pop up. What we want to do under file on our computer is to look for the shape file that we want to generate um, as a hosted feature service. Let's just choose this zipped DK Streetlights file. You'll notice it says publishes files of feature service but by default you need to include make need to make sure that's checked. And let's just call this street lights and we'll, we'll hit add item. So it's actually going to generate, or it's actually going to upload and generate um, a feature service from this uh, particular shape file. And there is the details page. Um, you'll see a link in the middle of the page here to that actual service. So what you're really doing here is actually leveraging a cloud-based ArcGIS feature server hosted by Esri to, uh, for this uh, particular feature service that we've uh, generated. And after a few flicks, there we go. We've now got that uh, service up. We need to select share. Now in this case, we're going to select everyone, so it's a public um, ac publicly accessible service. We can limit that to just our organization or different subgroups within our organization. So let's do that. Let's hit the edit button now. We're doing a lot of work with um, editing, particularly um, mobile editing, both offline and not online. Um, if we selected the, select the edit button and then scroll down to the bottom of the page, you actually see this editing option right here. Check that and it, this will enable editing of this uh, particular feature layer. And then let's save that. Okay, let's go ahead and look at uh, what we've got. So we're going to open and then open ArcGIS.com Map Viewer. And there's our point layer. We've got an edit button in the top left hand corner here since we enabled editing. Let's go ahead and click that. Now we can manage the uh, the features that are viewed that are visible here. If we click on the bottom left in the bottom right hand corner on the left in the left column, we get the manage button. We can actually go ahead and select that feature that features properties, and then what we want to do is give it a new name. Let's call it Street Lights. This is actually going to set up a renderer for us. Um, so we will uh, be able to not only uh, we'll actually be able to um, render this information and use it in an edit in an editing window on uh, on a mobile device, which is what our goal is um, in in doing this. Um, let's save those changes, and we're good to go. So we now have a hosted feature service in in our uh, ArcGIS Online account, which we can now use to uh, edit features. Um, both online and in our case uh, offline as well. Thanks for watching.